Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is your first time here. Today I'm sharing with you a tackle your to-do list video. So hopefully this will motivate you to get everything done that is on your to-do list today. Here is my to-do list for the day. So the first thing I did this morning was get in my morning workout. It is my favorite way to start the day. It always makes me feel great. So I'm gonna check that off my list. Next, I'm gonna make a nail appointment for later this evening. I need to get my nails done because we have family photos coming up in the next couple days. So I just made my nail appointment for later tonight. And now I'm going to clip the kids' nails. They were pretty bad. It's crazy how fast my kids' nails grow. Uh, I'm sure that's normal for every kid, I don't know. But it seems like I clip them like every five days or six days, and if I wait a week, they are looking terrible. If you are new to my channel, I would love it if you'd hit that red subscribe button and join my community here on YouTube. I post motherhood and lifestyle content three days a week, every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So if that's something you're interested in, I would love to have you here. I love creating content for this channel and I post lots of day in the life vlogs, um, decorating videos, motivational content like this one. So if that is something that you're into, I would love to have you stick around. So you might think it's weird that I added drink lots of water to my to-do list, but I'm not always the best about getting enough water in throughout the day. So I figured if I put it on my list, I would probably get it done. And so today I've already drank a lot of water and I'm feeling really good. So you should do the same. Now I'm gonna set up an activity for the kids to do today. I love this activity by Kids Play Tricks on Instagram. If you don't follow them, I will link them in the description box below. So you should go follow them for tons of toddler sensory activities and all kinds of things. We actually do their preschool curriculum at home. And so today we're doing this fun little like science experiment kind of thing with baking soda and vinegar and some blocks. And we're gonna do it outside because it will potentially make a mess. And and just let the kids have fun with this activity. So first the kids are gonna build some little structures with these blocks, but they're gonna build it upside down so that we can fill the blocks with some baking soda and then they'll use those little droppers to put vinegar on top and see it fizz over and overflow and create bubbles and all that. So my kids absolutely loved this activity. I highly recommend you trying it. It was so much fun and it was so simple to set up just using household items that you probably already have. So if you try it out, tag me on Instagram in it. But again, I got this activity from Kids Play Tricks. And then you can also add some dish soap on top to make extra bubbles. And you can also use food coloring if you want to just make it colorful and fun. But sometimes food coloring makes a mess and I just wasn't wanting to deal with that today. Now I'm going to get the dishwasher unloaded. And hey, let me know if you like this style of video. When you give these videos thumbs ups or you comment me and you let me know that you like this style of video, then I can always create more content like that. So I always enjoy when you guys engage with me and let me know what you think. But I actually love creating these videos and I don't know if it's just because I'm like the type of person who loves to-do lists. Like I love marking things off my list. So these videos are a lot of fun to film. So if you enjoy them, please let me know. And I can, of course, keep creating more things like this. I 
I noticed when I was putting out all of our Christmas decor that we had a couple of ornaments that broke. So this little silver pine cone just came detached from like the little string where you would hook it on your tree. And then the little feather fell off of Addison's flamingo ornament. So I'm just gonna hot glue both of these things back together and get them ready to go so I can hang the flamingo on Addison's tree and put the pine cone on our main tree. You know, I don't think it's possible for me to do a tackle your to-do list video and not include me doing some sort of laundry. I know it's probably like repetitive, but I seriously do laundry all the time and I almost didn't put it in this video, but I was like, it's something I need to get done today. So I might as well just keep it real and show you what I actually have to get done, even though I'm doing laundry every single time I film these videos. It's insane. <laughs> Thinking. It's like we're done before we even started So if this is the end now, baby Know that I gave him my all I'm leaving This is the third time I'm filling up my cup for the day and if I drink four of these in a day, I'm pretty sure that's a gallon. So anyway, that's always kind of my goal so I'm doing pretty good on my water today and feeling really good. Okay, you guys, don't judge me for how filthy my car is. It's embarrassing. But seriously, this happens in like a couple days. And if you are also a mom, I'm sure you can relate. But the kids just, Brody, not as much as Addison, but Addison just seems to get crackers and crumbs and just food everywhere every time we're in the car. And Steven gives me such a hard time about it. He's always like, your car is so gross. And I'm like, hey, you don't have kids eating in your truck 24 seven like they are in my car. So just is what it is. Every couple days I try to vacuum it out. And so here we are cleaning up my vehicle. So we are driving to Cabela's today. You know what my seatbelt? <laughs> today we're going to Cabela's. Say hi. Hi. And he's Addison. <laughs> we are in the car. And back here, that has the back seat. That's where I sit. And he's a glove right here. And this is me when I'm driving. Hey, uh, can, you watch, can you watch my car real quick? Hi. Bye. 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 <laughs> Now I'm just gonna cut Brody's hair, and his hair is actually not that bad right now, but I'm just gonna freshen it up so that it looks nice for the family photos that we have here in a couple days. Let me know in the comments what are some of the things that you have on your to-do list for the week. I just pulled up at the nail salon, so I'm gonna run in here and get my nails done really quick. I love white nails. It is my all-time favorite, and last time I got my nails done, I did a different color and then I instantly regretted it. So I just went with my tried and true white nails. And now I'm going to get our clothes washing that we are wearing in our family photos that are coming up. Actually, specifically just washing Steven's jeans and his shirt and Brody's shirt in this load. A couple other shirts too, but mine and Addison's stuff are light colored things, so I'm not washing them with their stuff. I'm gonna mark that off and I'm gonna go ahead and mark off drinking lots of water for the day because I did accomplish that and I feel so good. 
Now I'm going to whiten my teeth. This is the final thing I'm going to tackle on my to-do list today. We recently got this teeth whitener from Amazon and we have both been loving it. And Steven is using my ice roller also from Amazon, trying to get rid of his wrinkles. <laughs> he wanted to be in the video. So I'll link both of these products in the description box below. They're both really great. I wasn't able to get my car washed today because by the time I finished my nails, the car wash was closed and I need to figure out what memory card I need for Brody's little camera. So I'll have to do that later, but I feel really good about everything I got done today. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully it motivated you. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new to my channel and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.